Hey everybody and welcome to my studio. If you've seen some of my videos, you might have noticed that I'm always working with these workbenches and I get a bunch of comments about them all the time. So I decided this week I'm going to take the time and make a video why I love these workbenches, what's great to modify and how much they are, where to get them, all about the workbenches basically. These are actually not meant to be workbenches, those are stage elements. So whenever you go to a rock show or a concert, the stage is made of these elements. There are basically four reasons that made me buy these elements and use them as a workbench. And that's one, the size. They are two meters by one meter. That means you can just put down a full sheet of plywood and it's not wobbling around. Another thing is they're super, super strong. One square meter of this table can take 750 kilos load. That means the whole table can take 1,500 kilos no problem. The third reason is they're height adjustable. The special thing about these particular ones is that they have scissor legs. So if you have a bigger workpiece that you're working on, you can simply lower your workbench and still work on a comfortable height. And the fourth reason is the price. If you buy them new, I think they're super expensive. I always manage to get them used though, and I never paid more than 100 euros per bench. So that is very, very cheap for such a durable, heavy duty and big workbench. Now, I've been working with these benches for years, but there are two things, <laughs> but there are two things that I always wanted to try and never have. And since I'm building this new studio with a brand new bench, today is the day I'm going to try these modifications.
So this is the final setup and I have to say I kind of regret not doing these modifications earlier because it's so practical. The two major things that changed is the grid system that we drilled into the workbench top. That means with this we can use these clamps to hold down different work pieces. I also made an adapter out of these old bolts that can hold my magic arm like this and then this can hold my camera. Which will make filming top shots, filming very close to my work pieces super, super easy. We also made adapters for the lamps so you can easily switch the position of the lighting system so you can always have the light where you need it. And the second modification is the railing system around the workbench. We modified this clamp so I can now clamp work pieces vertically to the edge of the bench. I also made these wooden adapters that fit right into the railing and that means I can screw different things to the side of the bench like this power strip. I am super happy with this. I wish I had done that 10 years ago. This is so practical and I will do this modification to my other two workbenches as well. Again, these workbenches are pretty expensive if you get them new, but maybe look on Craigslist or ask at old venues if they have a couple stage elements flying around that they want to sell. I never paid more than 100 bucks for mine and it's really, really worth the money. I hope you enjoyed the video. I want to thank you guys for watching and I will see you next week with a new video. Come to the <laughs> Bye.